There's a lot of just fantastic things this year at Clio. I can't even begin to, to, to say, but I mean, the number of submissions we have is phenomenal. This is a record year for submissions. Um, and when you have that many just great papers, you get to pick the best of the best talks. In putting together the program, you know, we were really looking for broad participation from many different uh, parts of the optics and photonics community, um, particularly ranging from people doing applications-based research all the way to the fundamental science-based research. Um, and this year was a, was a great year for us. Um, we had a very large uh, turnout from all segments of the community. If you come to Clio, um, you get a broad perspective on a number of different fields. And what I find personally very good about Clio is, is the format of having different types of talks. In addition to the standard contributed talks, we have invited talks, but also we have these special tutorial talks. Uh, and in fact, in almost all of our different subcommittees, there's at least one tutorial. So in Clio, we have um, there's three main tracks within Clio itself. Um, the first track is the Fundamental Sciences track, um, and that has seven different uh, subcommittees or, or subtopics that go into various aspects of fundamental science around optics, um, electricity and magnetism, and laser-based physics. Um, the second area is the Clio SNI, or the uh, science and innovation. Um, and those are kind of a cross between the fundamental science and more applied technologies. Um, it focuses in on, on solid scientific principles, um, but yet it also tends to bring in some of the, the more interesting applications and other places where it's being used. Um, that's the largest of the Clio uh, track areas. We have 15 different subtopics, and these subtopics range from being about specific types of lasers, um, to being about optical materials and interaction in materials, uh, biophotonics and optofluidics. Um, we even have a couple sessions on, on green uh, technologies, um, photovoltaics, uh, light emitting diodes, things like that. Um, and finally, the third track is the applications and technology. And that's for talks on areas that are really beyond the fundamental science and more really into how we use the technology. Um, in that track, we have four different subcommittees, um, and those include things from uh, bio uh, photonics type things to industrial applications of lasers and laser processing, uh, governmental activities. In addition to that, they have a number of special tracks of programs um, that go on at the exhibit. Um, so for instance, there's a special session on the market focus. Um, and this session has a number of very interesting uh, topics to discuss this year, um, ranging from transitioning technology from your research lab into the real world um, to what's really happening in certain fields. Where's the, where's the technology? Where's the, the field going from an industrial side? Um, as a researcher, I find that type of talk really very beneficial because it allows me to put my own research into the context of the broader industrial world. Um, and this is something that is important, uh, especially nowadays as we see, you know, a lot of the exciting engineering work happening at that interface from, you know, what's going on in fundamental science to what I can really use in the outside world. So um, in terms of the other thing that's really notable about the trade show is that at Clio, um, we organize the conference so that there's special exhibit only time. So you don't have to feel like you're trying to decide between going to that next great talk or trying to see what the next great technology is. We have opportunities built into the schedule for you to be able to do both at this conference. One of the important uh, properties of these conferences over here is that we have a very good peer, uh, peer review system. So I mean, all submitted papers go really through a kind of hard peer reviewing it before being accepted as an oral or a poster presentation. So you will really find here a good collection of really high quality papers. We have as well quite a good number of invited talks. Right? And so these kind of uh, give quite often a good kind of core uh, to, to your sessions. And so that makes really high quality sessions. Uh, another very important thing, actually, of, of this conference is just the symposium. The symposium is really one of the attraction points of, of, of this conference. We have good invited uh, speakers, and we have as well topics that are really go going future direction. And uh, with this future direction of, of, of topics, that is something you can learn where is the field moving. And, and, and that is, uh, for sure, makes one important part why this conference is important.